A guest lecture was conducted on the 13th of February on the first floor of the central block for the first year master students of the Department of Media Studies. A talk with the founder and CEO of Pipeline. Graphology workshop conducted by the Department of Psychology. An interaction with the Director of Human Resources, Asia Pacific Region of Amazon India. A panel discussion was held on the 13th of February 2017 for the students of first year JEP and the first year master students of Media and Communications Department. The discussion was held on the topic, what are the implications of post-truth phenomenon for journalism in developing countries? The panelists present for the discussion were Mr. Ravi Srinivasan, editor at Business Line, Mr. John Yearwood, chairman of International Press Institute, Professor Chengappa BM, School of International Studies, was the moderator for this session. Some of the topics broached were the freedom of press in Turkey, Trump, and the role of media during the political campaigns of Trump, as well as Modi, and lastly, the concept of business journalism was discussed in depth. A guest lecture was conducted on the 13th of February on the first floor of the Central Block for the first year master students of the Department of Media Studies. I am not there because uh, I have gone to some rehearsals. I joined late and I see the atmosphere is already strong because my children have fought with him to their uncle because he has made some derogatory comments about the family who are in there and all kind of patriotic comments. They have been here. So there will be a body of uh, good people in government who will fund the village. And then uh, when Uma comes there. The main idea of the discussion was to enlighten the students to not blindly accept stereotypes and to constantly question the certificates endowed upon them by society. The students of the Department of Media Studies were given a rousing lecture by Mr. Soham Basak founder and CEO of the marketing company Pipeline. So apart from myself, I believe, uh, where is she? Andrika. So Andrika introduced me very well, but uh, uh, let me also introduce my colleagues here. Uh, Anurag here is my co-founder. Okay, uh, Anurag and I graduated at the same time from the same college. And uh, we have been working together for the last two and a half, three years or so. And uh, he is an operations specialist and he has worked in companies like this. If one planned carefully, all foreseeable risk could be avoided, could be avoided and profits gained as projected. <music> Graphology workshop conducted by the Department of Psychology. The Psychology Department of Christ University organized a workshop on Graphology on February 15th at the SS University. Internationally certified graphologist Gagan Arora conducted the workshop. The workshop included the uses of graphology and how it can be used as a method of personality. What handwriting analysis is and how does it reveal personality, predict the future, signature analysis and so on. More than 90 students participated in the workshop. The Department of Psychology organized an interaction with Mr. Raja Gopalan Raghavan, the Director and Head of Human Resources for the Asia-Pacific region of Amazon India. If you go into Amazon.com, um, uh, at the bottom of the page there is something called About Us, and, uh, or, or you can go into Google and check for Amazon Leadership Principles. Uh, there are 14 of them, there are a bunch of them, and it starts with uh, customer obsession to a variety of things. So what we do in our interviewing is to, is to uh, and we call them competencies, and we look for 
we, we ask questions that actually will give us answers. Our interviewing is to, is to uh, and we call them competencies. And we look for, we, we ask questions that actually will give us answers. The session began with a brief introduction of Mr. Raghavan, where he spoke about his past experiences and the number of companies that he had worked at, including GE. He encouraged the students to ask as many questions as possible and also gave them encouraging tips and tricks on how to crack the Amazon interview and what kind of qualities that the company looked for in an individual. That's it for this week's news. Thank you for watching. This is Ashwini Shajan and that's the way the news goes.